Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific a crackling atmosphere the match i think will be quite a spectacle the emirates stadium in all its glorious modernity this symbol of new arsenal the arsenal of the 21st century and already we're underway here well as box office names go peter david beckham is right up there yeah he gets the turnstiles clicking that's for sure but footballing qualities well i think any defense is going to be nervous because of the sheer quality he can produce especially over a dead ball yeah not just that i think in open play he can deliver for fun too Beckham, aimed long and direct. Van Dijk, little doubt, that is a foul. Van Dijk gets his final warning. Yeah, and he has to change his ways or this referee could soon change his status. Promising move that, good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Over to the left. Tielemans gets it back. He's got away. Messi, De Gea, he's very much switched on to make that. So, Jim, a few notes on the opposition. What can you tell me about them? They do prefer... Fires from distance. That is wayward. Another example of how comfortable this team is on the break. Battles to win it back. Messi. Oh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. Luis Gustavo, Cristiano Rup has a pop! Forward it goes, a real chance to break. Tries to get it forward quickly. It's beautiful, intricate passing, they are toying with their opponents. Well, they know that their version of what they do is extremely good. I mean, it's a level of possession that leaves the opposition chasing shadows. Luis Gustavo, Mbappe, out wide to the right, back into the middle, played out to the right, delivery from up for the header, goal! Oh, an absolute gem of a cross, it made the header simple. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch and it was fully deserved, he gave it everything he had. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. It's so often the case with goal scorers, little influence, and all of a sudden, bang. Oh, the ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Looks to go in for goal! What about it? Arsenal are level. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. That has certainly made things interesting. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you're pegged back again. He's had a shot! He's scored! And they're back in front! 
and however many surrounded him, that is what he can do. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a eel the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of, now you've got him, now you don't. Brilliant. So we have a breakthrough. Listen, when it comes to goals, Peter, in this team, he's always the number one contender, and he's done it again. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Well positioned to make that interception. Mohamed Salah. Just ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Going through. Aimed long and direct. Messi. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo plays it out to the wing. And it's Beckham. Hit long and direct. And the whistle's gone, presumably for offside. Played back in. Forward it goes. Now it's Mohamed Salah. Tries to dink it in. Messi. Pushes it out wide. Messi. And Messi! He's done very well to get to that. Messi is very sporting here. To and the referee brings the first half to a close. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. Well, we've had plenty to go at in that first half, Peter, and it's a, a fragile lead that could quite easily change hands in, in the second. Uh, if you like your football unpredictable, I think you're at the right match. And the game has already resumed here. Arsenal don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back, though. Oh, good interception. And now they can launch a counter. He's found his man. Messi. And the finish! Really well taken goal. The second half off to a spectacular start. Arsenal are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Quite a thriller this one's become. Ah, oh, look, Peter, I was on the fence before a ball was kicked, and uh, I still haven't moved. Lovely feet. He's left his man. And he's there to cut it out. Messi. He's good for it. Goal! Ah, he was never going to miss from there. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was are absolutely top-notch. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. And that's been one straight back. Forward it goes. And Dyke cuts it out. And now the breakaway. PK positions himself well and cuts it out. And he's made certain that won't get through. Aimed long and direct. Long ball, but not especially accurate. We can assume that they've been instructed by the boss to, to stay in attack. They're just looking to break, aren't they? Yeah, the key net shoots! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. 
Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Going through. Can he find a fit? Shakes the shoots. But this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Well, I hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Traore. Hostel claiming a corner, and the referee concurs. And a header! Oh, not the best of headers. been intercepted and that will come to nothing and it's Azar Pulls out on the left now he's got away he's come loose now it's Azar looking to shoot it's a goal and with that goal comes Comfort! Calm, composed, confident. What a super goal. Ah, oh, that's just clever. He made the keeper think he was going one way, only to outfox him by going the other. Very nice. So the lead now is two. Listen, it's up to them now how they think about it from here, because for me it's crying out for them to force the issue. And it's been taken straight back. Going through. And this is my Shoots! They've scored! Just one goal in it now! Game on! Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. Well, considering he has a bit of a, a shoot-on-sight policy, he was the one player that should have been picked up then. It was both careless and costly from where I'm sitting. We have got ourselves a game here. Well, they've given themselves a chance here, but now it's a case of getting the balance right between attack and defence, and that's not easy. Mohamed Salah! Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Almost there, and the players can feel it. Ball through needs to be good here. Hits one! Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue this situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. And that is it. The referee has seen it up. Hostel winners after an absolutely outstanding game. Fabulous drama as they dragged it back from behind, made it happen and won. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen?